Bugs. But Tommy G, Tommy G, Tommy G. Bro, I just watched that Rico video, bro. Tommy G, you get a Rico for being in the New York gang scene, bro. Watch out. I'm Tommy G. I'm here in the Bronx at the oh, East Tommy. Chester Gardens. Welcome to the drill music scene, baby. And we're here to explore drill music. Let's get it. Before we go to the Bronx, first we have to talk about boo and like pack. With a drill emerging voice and aggressive style, he's emerging as a major player in the world of drill music. Talk drill emerged from Chicago and has found another home in Trip. New York. Drill rappers are known for saying crazy and threatening bars. For example, Trip. Shah G's has a line that goes. Some of these words result in real life violence. Today, we explore drill yeah, further and head to the East Chester Gardens to speak with Shah and his crew and get an inside look at his life. It's not every day you get to wake up and head to the project. I feel like so much of rap Yo. history comes from places like this. This group is absolutely popping. Like the moves they make, here's a couple songs right now. Oh yeah, this is, this is, this is crazy. So we're meeting some kids that could be- Yo, Tommy, you wild and wake up and eat thugs. The next New York legend. How you guys doing? Good to meet you, Shaw big dogs. My name's Shaw G, from the Bronx. I'm a drill rapper. You know, we outside, like, other than that, you know, we get money. Damn, that nigga's tooth is fucked. Money. God damn. You guys are putting up crazy numbers. Is that blowing your mind how big you're getting, how quick it's going? Oh yeah, that's a fact. It's like, this shit, like, this shit happened overnight. This shit crazy, like. I be bugging, I be like, damn, man, I really did that shit. Where are we right now? Tell the people where we are. How many people live in this place? Probably like more than the whole city of Milwaukee live in this spot. Oh yeah, what's the lingo around here? Like, if I want to try and blend. Word to my mother. Word to my mother. Don't play with me, alright? Word to my mother. Don't do. Word to my. Don't play with me, alright? What am I ten like? <laughs> and then oh, what words do oh, I gotta know? Oh, simple shit. Oh, simple yeah, shit. Yeah, simple shit for me. Like just basic shit. Yeah, basic shit. Like, Baba. What the hell is that? What? Baba. A thotty. Oh yeah, I've I met a couple of those in my day. I try and stay away though. You know yeah, what I mean? You, you guys ever bust out push-ups or pull-ups around here or what? Um. I feel like busting out What's a bunch that? of push ups uh, right now. Oh, okay, Thai. <laughs> what <laughs> hand? <laughs> you want to tell me. Big dogs gotta eat. Let's go. How old are you? 18. So you're young. Damn. That nigga, my age. And you probably have your DMs absolutely flooded. I mean, you're becoming yeah. a famous rapper. Yeah. What is that like? How do you navigate the floods of DMs and the women? I appreciate all my fans. Everybody know these vibes. Everybody know how I feel about them. All the haters can suck my d though, you heard? Do you have any girlfriends? No. Are no. you trying to stay single for a while? Keep doing my little thing, getting money. Right now, you're focused. Get money at Once you make it big, demon woman, you ready for allocation. Then you can think about women. Right. For all these men that's getting depressed about these females, oh, man. Oh. Fuck these bitches. Get man. some money. But he has. Get some no, money, man. Get some money. Don't be depressed. A lot of people have come from the Bronx to make things happen. Were there people that you looked up to on the journey as you're coming up? Who did you look up to? I didn't really look up to nobody and shit, but like, for me, like, music wise and shit, like, yeah. new baby and shit, GP, uh, Lil Durk. What does it mean to be a drill rapper? There's a lot that come with this shit, you know? Yeah, Y'all just really go crazy in this shit, like, what, if you believe in yourself, go crazy, bro. Don't ever have doubts about yourself. That's how you're not gonna make it nowhere, bro. We were in the Diamond That's District bad. before we came here, and when I told people we were coming here, they said, be careful, there's a war going on. Is that exaggerated, or what do you think about that? Good child, good child. We don't know what they're talking about. We don't, we don't know, don't know violence, no, everything we say is just music. You have a line that made me laugh. It was something like, if I- Let's cap. Let's be real, bro. You is not trying to get a Rico. You are not trying to get a Rico like the rest of those Bronx niggas. See him, I'm a kick his stroller. I'm gonna see somebody kick his stroller. <laughs> 
Hey, we'll talk on that though. Is there any New York handshakes? Because I, I was in Water Hill and they have some like crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Nah, nah, the the yeah, clean, See, that's nah, what I'm nah, talking nah, about. Nah, this Jesus nigga. <laughs> Wait, I feel like oh, I, need to, I have to study for like three years to get that correct. Yeah. So I'd imagine you guys are pretty well known in the area. What is that like? Tell me about that. They're having a big family. Yeah, yeah that's a thought. We all big family. ass family. So you guys thinking you'll stay in the Bronx long term, or you guys gonna get fancy and go to LA, or like mm. what's in the plans, guys? What's in the plans? Yeah, we should, okay. man, we, should we, go, a, we should take a trip overseas. Man. Not bad. Overseas hoes, feel me? You guys want to go overseas? overseas hoes. Yeah, do you see yourself living in New York, or do you ever want to move to another place? Definitely move to another place. Yeah, but right now, for me, I'm making New York live right now. When you're putting up a, a few hundred thousand hits in like five days on a video, like you are making mm. big waves, dude. No, no, no. Dang. I'm trying to keep my head on the right track. For yeah. me, that's what I be trying to do. I mean, get shit done. Because no matter what the numbers are, the mission's always the same. It's work mm. hard, record good yeah. shit, entertain oh, shit. people, keep making moves, right. right? So this is it. This is it. Uh, what does it mean to get started? Moving sex, so I steal my pivot. I could be dead or a journey minute. We up next. Fuck a visit, like I'm trying to move out the whole way. Yeah, you got, yeah, yeah, you got hop, 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 hop. So if I, if I had bigger space, I'll be getting started right now. Yes. Go home and start crying. Or what? No, 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 no. The dance moves in Milwaukee is like this. It's like you do this. Shout out to the 414 certified Trevor. Y'all know the. Hey, oh, hey, hey, oh. Shout out to my guy, hey, certified hey, Trevor, by the way. Hey, 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 music to me has a very intense energy to it. How would you describe it? This shit go, lit, boom, man. It's the type of music that people go. You start they, getting out shows. That shit going to be crazy. Man. The mosh pits at your show are going to be crazy. Oh, shit going to sell out. So do you write your shit? You freestyle your shit or a little bit of mix? A little bit of mix. So like, Sometimes I'll be having days where I want to write. Sometimes I have days I want to freestyle. Sometimes I have days I want to write and freestyle. So when we go to the studio tonight, you're prepared with what you want to do or are you just going to hold the spot kind of just go? You just hold the spot and just kind of just go. Yeah, all right. Were you guys born or raised? I can do a hundred puzzles. In the gardens. Right. If you had one meal left on earth, what would you eat? Popeye's chicken. Yeah? I love that. Uh, that nigga didn't say KFC. Chicken for Popeye's. <laughs> Popeye's, if you want to sponsor this guy, let's get it done. Is anything on the bucket list? Like, hey, when everything's said and done, I want to have done this. Like, is there anything on that list for you that really stands yeah. out? Rolling loud. Rolling loud? I see myself in rolling loud next year. Did you play any sports? You got that tall frame. Yeah, I used to play ball. When you, when you get a lot- This nigga's 18. Fuck. A lot of money. What do you want to spend it on? Fuck. Houses, investing shit for me. Get, get properties, get real myself, estate. Get all that, everything. The only way to true wealth is to own something. Fuck. Fuck. What do you see yourself as a 40-year-old 40, 40 man doing? Millionaire. Do you okay, see not, yourself with a family? <laughs> what did I tell you? But I tell you, get some of that. Enjoy it. The people we talked to said that we were stupid. I love it. Okay. I'm like, you know No, what? absolutely not, man. We have a good time. We live good here, too. We went down for the barbecues, man. We don't want that tough name shit, man. We got love here, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. We yeah. not even on that. We on shit. That's all it is. Just don't bring yeah. it up. Does the MIP not play? Because I've heard like other, some cities I go to, people, they feel like the police don't do shit. But around here, it feels like police well, get after it. Well. Yeah, they got detectives. That's why. Do you have any stories from like uh, like no, uncles or dads or anything that like experienced like things really Rico. tough from the NYPD? But now that there's they got like five Rico's after them. Body cams has gotten better. See shit like that. It's a little bit easier now though. Before the niggas used to come around, yeah, throw you in the truck, they take you like over there and they beat your ass and bring you back. That ass. It's Earth Day coming up at 420. Are you you feel bad to the Earth when you do that? Yeah. What if a bird chokes on that and dies? Then it happens. Will you go to the bird's funeral and like give it a flower? What do your grandmas think about drill music? Whatever gets you right. Yeah. Does she ever listen to drill music, your grandma? No, nah, hell when, no. when she's in her car cruising around, she's... My grandma like cuss me out. What does your grandma think about your music? She's not jacking out. Like, does she ever say like, you need to tone it down? Yeah? Hell yeah. What do you say to her after that? It's over, yeah. 
why would I stop? So when you go to school, people know, like, mm. I'm assuming everyone knows who you are, right? Yeah, that's mm -hmm. crazy. What's that like walking through the hallway? I don't go to school. You don't go to school? Mm. When did you decide to leave? Basically when your rap started blowing up? Mm. Did you guys say you're happy? I see how maintaining you are. Yeah. You think money buys you happiness? No. Nah, but the money can can't make buy you your life. You die. So we're taking. Mmm. I was crazy. Mmm. In the local advice, enjoying the local cuisine. You got chopped cheese here? Yeah. I want chopped cheese from the deli. Fuck. What brought you to this area? Chopped cheese. <laughs> you heard of him? Yes, I definitely heard of him. Uh, he's like my nephew. Mm -hmm. I grew up under his mom, you know, so I seen him come up. Yeah, started, what is it yeah. like to have a guy that lives right by you start to blow up? Contrary to popular belief, my area has put off a good significant amount of talented people. So he's one of the first major, definitely. But, you know, we've seen this type of thing before. Well, now, folks, it's time mm. to eat some chopped cheese, baby. <laughs> have a good night. I want a chopped cheese. These fellas had a good recommendation. Now that we've fueled up, it's time to drive back into the city, hit the studio. I think it's going to be a little bit wild. Stand clear of the boom. Like, go with these see my old face. How my dress get down like a lace when I'm flick on a beam and go pick up the pace. Like, don't run, he go get chased. Who number one? Bitch, this ain't. Yeah. 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 Nice to meet you, How you doing? Good to see you. Yeah. So I thought I, I thought I said Chris Long films. If y'all, if you know what I'm saying, Chris Long films. Tactically, these last. I thought I thought I saw Chris and like Doc and Mary. Couple months, but yeah. it's, it's it's been nice, you know. What makes it hectic? It's always working. Whether it's studio, video shoots, getting with that Dior puffer. For new producers every week, all that type of stuff, it gets crazy. Is it amazing you to oh, see the success outside. of like he puts out a song and it gets a quarter million, half a million views just insane. like that? It's great, especially the last two songs he put out, Papa Perry and this new one, Talk My Shit Forward, did 100k in 24 hours. Let's get back. Damn, isn't that insane? Is there any New York lingo that you've learned listening to your music? Of course. What, what are, are some ten? words that you can break down for us? The number one's gotta be cheeks. cheeks. You know, that's, that's, that's Shaz's thing, you know. I heard Mike them saying that. that. Cheeks, 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 cheeks. They were saying it before? Yes, yes. What can you tell us about the music scene I mean. in New York right now? What's got you excited? Uh, it's, it's a lot of good up and comers, bro. It's probably the most live I've ever seen it. Yeah. And obviously we got the drill scene going crazy in New York, so it's... Are you recording the Shaz session? I'm not doing the Shaz session. Okay. Now. Drill music is what's taking yeah. the city by storm. Mm -hmm. What's your take on it? Anything that's gonna put New York back on the map is fire to me, bro. I come from when it, this was the epicenter of music. So if this is the beginning of kind of that coming back over me, then I'm with it, I'm for it. As far as like the negativity surrounding it, which I get, but I mean, when I was it's growing up, yeah, we had huh? the same type of shit. It wasn't, there was people who didn't like what Word we were doing. Yeah. I was listening to G Unit and all of that, so. And when you were growing up, who did you look up to in the rap? That's what I'm saying. I have 50. It's not no different than that. So mm. I still to this day don't believe there's a, a run that was as quick and huge. Like, I've never seen something like that. How fast it came, it took over the world. You ever have to be careful booking a session with different drill rappers to yeah, make sure they don't... To, we got to talk about that. Yeah. We got to talk about the politics and shit. So you kind of have to do a little bit of homework before you book people? Have you ever had something go down here? Nah. Where it's like, oh, you try to be smart about it. So this is obviously the lobby. Damn. This is where we kind of show off all the things that we do. <laughs> and this is uh, the two, two owner studio, studio manager. They're active business partners for Wow, Pop Smoke. This Kehlani, Joey Badass. <sighs> Rip Pop, bro. Rip Pop. So wait, Joey Badass may have pooped in the same toilet as I might poop in? Yes. That's pretty sweet. Yes. <laughs> So this is the master room. This is like the last step. In Where does the, the artist go? They don't. Or usually this is by themselves. So usually here, after you track, you're upstairs. You track. Then an engineer comes. They mix the joint. And the master and part of the process is to sort of get it up to like industry standard, as loud as it possibly can, without it distorting. There's nothing like when you get that song just complete and you hear it in the studio. Mm -hmm. It's probably the best place to hear that or the car. Hey, I'm Tommy. Hey man, Alex. Nice Dang. to meet you. <laughs> Have you seen any of his videos? Um, this like you seen a whole bag of story of all these songs that's crazy nah he's a wild child i just looked through his instagram like an hour ago that's it okay look shit sound good I feel like when he raps it's like he's gonna just catapult through the door a little bit you know what i mean <laughs> yeah. how long does it take the average rapper to make a song would you say 
It's different <laughs> for everyone. You know, some people be taking like three weeks. Some people just get a song done in like five minutes. Yeah, you yeah. know, it really it's just different. There's no average. What's your guys' wow. bet with Shaw? How how long do you think it's gonna take for you to make a song? Yeah, 30 minutes. 20, 30 like minutes. 15. You think you have 15, 15 minutes? Because a lot of these songs are like a minute and a half. Yeah. yeah. You guys ever had something crazy go down in the studio before? We had Pop Smoke here. Yeah, that whole video, that classic video, Pop Smoke yeah. in the studio doing singing Dior. Oh, crazy. What was that like? I was here that night. That shit. That was crazy. It was crazy. Yeah, it must have been electric. Like, what do you see as the impact of drill music? It's more of a trend kind of thing. Like it's also like a quick way to get popping or like you know start your own thing. You know. Yeah. A lot of it just like people talking shit to each other, but or do you feel like the kids take it very seriously that they actually want to like gun each other down? It's beef, but like I don't think a lot of these people are really like that. What's up, man? How you been, man? How you What's doing? So I hear today that we're recording more of like a love song, friend? huh? Oh no, probably. How you guys doing? No, no, no dangerous. Live is living dangerous. Cheeks. 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 Guess what I call my wife? Oh, I call her sweet cheeks. 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 She's got them <laughs> cheeks. <laughs> Do you guys love hitting the studio and just going crazy on the yeah. snack bar? What's uh, your favorite nah. candy bar of the bunch? The the Snickers, you feel me? I'm gonna drop the craziest it's drill mm -hmm. verse in history. Mm -hmm. How about that? All right. Yeah, that's right. We got it. 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 <laughs> okay, my voice messed up. <laughs> and that's it. It's gonna be like a six second release. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Six, yeah. All right, I want a proposition, Shaw. I say a couple ad libs. I'll talk crazy shit. But let me hear what you what you's going with. You know what the f time it is, mother. <laughs> <laughs> it shot G's nah. in this motherfucker. Yeah. Watch out! Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna clap your cheeks. Yeah. Yeah. I'll take your grandma on a date if you don't f with this track. What's the vibe we're going for through today? Probably some Jersey clubs. I don't know yet. I mean, we're gonna get in there and some shit though. You think you're gonna make a love song today? Like a Netflix and chill type of a drill song? Oh, no, no. Cool. We're excited. We're excited, man, to see you do your thing. How long does it usually take you to make a song? Like two hours. Okay. Oh wow. And does your voice ever go hoarse? Because you got. Hell yeah. yeah. All the time. We your top five out of New York, though. Continue of all week. time. Yeah. Fifty cents on that list. Immortal Technique is on that list. You guys know Immortal Technique? Mm -mm. Mm -mm. He's a Harlem guy, like old school underground type oh, shit. Oh. Actually, the nigga name is Immortal Technique. Nah. What? Yeah, Do you guys think Tupac's York, still bro. alive? Nah, man. Nah, I think Michael, Michael Jackson's Jackson still alive. Still alive. Mm -hmm. Michael Jackson. Yeah? That nigga alive. He in a trench of Jackson alive. Yo, yo, y'all seen that um oh. that rich nigga? He had the oh, island. Um, you know what I'm talking Je about? Jeffrey Epstein. Yeah, yeah, Michael Jackson probably over there. Do you feel like he killed Jeffrey. himself or do you feel like he got taken out? You talking about Jeffrey Dahmer? Like Jeffrey Epstein. Nah, yeah. Epstein, yeah. Yeah, but you guys got Epstein, so don't even... No, don't do that, don't do that, don't do that. When he Dahmer killed 12 people, your guy touched children. Yeah, yeah, that's it. That's worse, that's, that's, that's worse, but that's a fact. He was taking the good ones off the market, you heard? Mm. <laughs> Get the names out of here. Do you guys trust the government? Not at all. Joe no. no. Biden. You don't belong Suck here, bro. You're a robot. That nigga's a robot, bro. Joe Biden's a robot? Yo, who the black nigga? That nigga about to get like 50 grand in taxes. Be wild and too. No. Yo, mayor. Boy, mayor. Oh, I see that. Big brother. Carter. I ain't gonna lie, you bro, so I ain't gonna lie, I'm not even gonna lie, I'm not even gonna lie, I fuck with you, bro, I told you, you, you a cool nigga, man, I appreciate it, guys, you know what about the trannies, bro? Hell no! Bro, look how the world doing that shit, bro. Yeah, this like world you, is crazy. You know like, you're I'm up kids. God's plan? Yeah, like, if you was born with kids, a dick, bro, nigga, kids, swing your bitch. Niggas trying to switch it up and... Word, trying to have like five yeah. genders and shit. He's the best, dude. Bow, 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 bow. Things are blowing up. Things are moving <laughs> fast. What does it feel like? Easy, <laughs> boy. Say bless you. I'm gonna lie, bro. I'm happy for my brothers, bro. How long is it taking to blow up? It took like a year, two years to see this shit blow up. What are you most excited for in the future? We all rich, living up, get a body or two, bro. You wanna yeah. leave New York? Yeah, well, we're gonna leave this shit. So the come up is a once in a lifetime journey. Like, what is it like that the crew is popping, shot oh, Jesus popping? What does it feel like? I feel like we going up, bro. Is it exciting? Like, is it, does it make you nervous? Like, how does it feel to have. It's, it's exciting. It don't make me nervous. It made me more alert, you know? Did you ever think in your life that you were gonna be part of a, in the crew of a very successful rapper? I always knew we was gonna do something, you feel me? Gangsta since we was young. 
What's your advice to anyone that's coming up in the rap game? Believe in yourself, bro. Keep grinding. Gangsta. So what we're witnessing, folks, is the art of creation. And what's crazy is some guys can take three minutes, other guys can take three months to make a song. But bro, when Juice will take like three seconds, bro. Freestyle will drop it the next day. You're a sculptor. On one billion views. A painter, a rapper. We all have that little light inside our soul that says, create, be something. Create God. Something. Create something bigger than yourself. And who knows, when he puts this song out, maybe it changes a generation. You never know what's gonna happen with your creation until you launch it out to the world. And that's the fun of being an artist. <laughs> How do you feel when you're in the booth in the studio? I regular, like, I don't know. Is it crazy that what comes out of your mouth next? I think I need to invest in some braces while I'm money. Next could be the next hit. Right. Let's get it, dude. Let's get it. We get money, we do All right, folks, that's like the episode. What? This was an inside well, look yeah. into the Bronx, yeah. drill music, and well, youngsters that are making it happen in New York. Like we'll see you guys next yeah. week. Yeah. Jay. Yo. Jay, Jay.